No, I don't believe in deja vu. Do you know what deja vu? My, my maths teacher so said to me that deja vu is not a real thing, right? You have not lived these events before, yeah? There's certain times where I feel like, oh, I might be having deja vu. Have I lived this before? My maths tutor said to me, you know, like, apparently it's scientifically proven, right, that all it is, when you experience deja vu and you feel like you've lived certain events before, it's your mind is slowing down, right? It's almost like you're tired or something like that, right? And your mind thinks it's done it before. And it's as simple as that, right? It ain't no supernatural stuff, ain't it? Yeah? Guys, stop be looking for things to believe in, yeah? <laughs> stop looking for just little silliness to believe in, yeah? You know, you know what it is? A lot of these people that believe in all, all of these things, yeah? Uh, tarot card reading, yeah? Uh, fucking fly, flying um, unicorns, God, ghosts, yeah? Spirits, karma and all of that, yeah? It's the same thing as little children believing in Santa Claus and Father Christmas. Yeah? It's exactly the same thing. Yeah? It's just, you ain't gotten over that child. It's almost like it's a, a hangover from childhood. Yeah? Whereas when we're children, we can accept, oh, okay, there's no Santa Claus, there's no Father Christmas. Yeah? But somehow when we get older, we can't accept that there's no God or Ghost, ghosts don't exist or tarot card readers are full of shit yeah somehow we still believe in flying unicorns and the sasquatch <laughs> and the loch ness monster and horse tranquilizer yeah? we can't forget about these things yeah yeah I've, i'm sure i've heard of a religion that um worship spongebob but it's just stupid man people always need to believe in stuff it's just ridiculous Ridiculous, man. Church of SpongeBob, you know. Man said the Cardi B fan base, you know. Boy, I, I, I will not be at no Cardi B um, fan base. Yeah, the spaghetti monster. There's people who believe in the spaghetti monster, you know. Come on, man. But, but, you see, you see a Christian or a Hindu, or someone of any other faith, they will say that believing in the spaghetti monster is totally ridiculous. But from an atheist point of view, right, I could say that all other religions, yeah, that you are all the same. Yeah, All the religions say, I could say, well, yeah, you believe in uh, an elephant god, yeah, or you believe in a god that there's no actual picture of, right, or you believe in a book or whatever, in here. so... The spaghetti monster, like, it seems quite silly and childish to the average person, whatever, isn't it? Yeah, but from an atheist mind, right, they're all the same, right? You lot all might as well believe in SpongeBob or fucking the starfish, yeah, or the spaghetti monster, yeah, or the fucking talking pillow, yeah? It's all the same, yeah? It's all make-believe, yeah? That's what I believe, anyway. Listen, Nadia, you think these men are joke? They, 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 listen, this is serious stuff. There's people that believe in spaghetti monster. There's people that believe in um, the SpongeBob. Yeah. There's people who even worship aliens. I saw a fucking documentary on it. There's people that stand on the fucking mountain top, just like the mountain top in, in Scotland or somewhere like that. I think they weren't in Scotland. It was in America, holding hands in a massive circle, praying to the alien gods or whatever. It's the same thing. 